Emotional <laughs> blowout. And here's the hostess of our show, Miss Vanna Black. for me because I'm used to it and I think that I should win this contest hands down. Thank you Miss Belton. Yes. Now Miss Marvina Wallbanger. Tell us a little bit about yourself Marvina. Well, see my name is Marvina Wallbanger and I'm part of Hippie and part Rally Girl and see I don't work except in a beauty salon. I clean up the place. That's what I do. That's all. That's enough. Thank Please. you. Okay, ladies. Now, okay, what we're going to do is first I will read off some questions and they, Marvina, you will have the first chance. Now, if you get it wrong, then the question will go to Miss Belcher's Airhead. And after a few questions, we will have some bonus ones, okay? And the bonus questions will be worth 50 points <laughs> and the regular questions will be worth 10. Are we ready to start our game now? Yeah. All right. Okay, what color is an orange? <laughs> oh, an orange. No, let's see. Well, I just had an orange this morning, but it had fur on it. And, but, but, it, but it's an orange. Oh, Lord. Do I have to tell what this really? An orange is, of course, orange. Thank you. Now, that is ten points for Miss Airhead. Oh. Okay, <laughs> now the score is ten. Oh, it's now ten to zero on Miss Wallman. Don't worry about it. Okay, your question is, how long is a typical eyelash? Ah, oh, that's an easy one. Well, if you're going to use, like, mascara, you'll be five feet long. But if you're going to use, like, the knees, you know, press on them, they're, they're extremely large. Extremely. Uh, honey, that meant, yeah, what? Is it, uh, we press on, aren't they thinner than that? Well, yes. But, okay. May I have the question, please? Yes, Miss Airhead. Well, could you repeat it? <laughs> How long is a typical eyelash? Well, it, according to my calculations, if you multiply by pi 3.14 by the diameter of the eyelash, then it should come out to be an average of 0.11 inches. But of course, it's going to vary from person. Excuse me, from person to person. Don't try to steal my answers because you couldn't understand them. <laughs> Very good, Miss Airhead. Now that is 10 points for Miss Airhead. Back from that short commercial break. And beep beep, it is time for our bonus question worth 50 big points. Okay, listen closely. Would you calm yourself down, Miss Wallbanger? Thank you. Now, I'm going to play this short part of a song. Please, Miss Wallbanger. This short portion of a song. Miss Wallbanger, if you cannot, if you cannot. Okay, are you ready? <laughs> 
I'm ready. This is worth 100 points and the game. Alright. Easy. Now, draw a picture of an isotope. Oh, an isotope. <laughs> um, excuse me, could it be of any element? An isotope of any element? Yeah. An any isotope. An any isotope. Okay. Ready to come. Give me a pen. Go, fetch. Marjorie, it's useless. <laughs> Where do you think he's got the 50 points? <laughs> now, if we cannot contain ourselves <laughs> in this right. game it's show, then, then, I will have to, then, then I will have to lose my temper. Do you want me to lose my temper with you? Quick. Now sit down and control yourself. I'm sitting. I'm Why can't, why can't you act like an airhead? It's wrong. A name like airhead. Oh, get serious. Well, I'm drawing! You have five seconds. See? Your time is up. Mm -hmm. Now, okay. <laughs> Miss Wallbanger, will you come here and let me see your drawing and I can say it. Can I see yours in their hand? Banger. It's a ceiling. A toe. With an eye. An eye toe. And that's this. This is an airhead. That's just a big circle. Let's, that's it. Let's let our audience be the judges. Now, you audience. Think this woman is really intelligent. Oh, God. Let's, you cannot, see, let's see the drawings. <laughs> okay. Now for 
with a big, big question for the end of the game, okay? What? Okay, now you're going to have to do some essay form. You're going to have to stand up and say it to the camera. <coughs> okay, <coughs> you first, Mr. Boyd. What is the origin of your name? Well, I'll tell you, my mom, she said I had a bad habit of being with the lady. Don't say that to my buddy! Oh, my God. Sorry. Oh. Sorry. I saved your life. But I have a bad He's habit. He's an animal. I smell perfume when I start going into convulsions. <laughs> you smell donkey poop and you go into convulsions. <laughs> 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 okay. Okay, Mr. Boyd. Now you, Miss Bell, for their head. Well, of course, like I said before, my name came originally from England, and it's closely related to the, excuse me, <laughs> to the family of Prince Charles. And if the truth is to be known, I am truthfully Prince Charles's second cousin, and that's the origin of my name, of which I'm very proud. Okay. Like this. Okay. Now we are going to let our audience judge those. Oh my gosh. Yes. So, we will be back in a moment. Mavis, you better vote for an audience. Mavis, I'm... And uh, our fe all-female audience, oh, excuse me, one gentleman, have voted now. And for Mrs. Bellstrad Airhead and Mrs. Marvina um, Wallbanger, yes, many names, okay, the one gentleman voted for them. And his, name was, all? his name was Mr. Peter Herman. <laughs> Is that all? Uh. Okay, now for Miss Pee-wee, baby, I told you not to. Repeat it. Okay. Now, the one gentleman in our audience voted for Mrs. Wallbanger and Mrs. Airhead, and so that was their one vote. Okay, now for our Mr. Boy. Oh, wait, wait, could you could you tell me who it is? Mr. Boy. No, 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 no. Mr. Who voted for them? Mr. Pee-wee Herman. Okay. Okay. Now for Mr. Boy in our all-female audience, excluding Mr. Pee Wee Herman, you have 200 votes. You are our new champion, and you will be this high tomorrow. This is it. This is like two. Goodbye. On that note, blowout.